hi everyone so here i come back with another video on html these are the topics that will be taken in this video let's start first we'll type the basic format of coding and then close the tags in the correct order for today our first topic is the inserting of image there are mainly two ways to insert an image we'll try both the ways its syntax for using the images img src so the first way is we'll type the name of the image and then the extension we had done this way in the previous video and now we'll try the second way the second way says we'll first go to the properties of the image that we have to insert from here we'll copy the location then the name of the image and then the extension so from here we'll copy the location first then with the backslash we'll copy the name of the image and then the extension this value is also in the quotation marks i have saved this file so now we'll just refresh it as you can see here the image has been inserted but here as i have not applied the attributes of height and width so the image is like this now let's try the attributes of image first is height and width it determines the dimension of the image syntax says here we'll write height equal to the height and width they are given in percentage so suppose 50 and width also it's also we'll give here suppose 50% now we'll refresh the web page as you can see these attributes have been applied the next attribute for today is the border it is used to apply border to your image in html the border is applied only of black color other colors would be added in css so here we write border equal to suppose we take it 20 the value should be in quotation marks again we refresh the web page as you can see here the border has also been applied to your web page the last attribute of image is the align you can align your image left right top or bottom any of it syntax says align equal to in quotation marks suppose we take it right now we save it and refresh as you can see the image has been aligned to the right side you can also use other alignments but when you have to align your image in the center if you do it align center then it would not work like we can try it center refresh your web page so it will not be in center as this syntax is not for image if you want to align your image in the center we'll use other way here we'll type center a container tag and so now we we'll close it again refresh your web page as you can see here the image has now been aligned to the center so you can practice this this is all for this video With this video we have completed all the basic concepts required to make a web page. This is the practice revision of all the topics that have been covered till now. Try to write the code. Hope you liked my video. See you in the next with a new topic. Thank you.